Skills Development Fund, SDF, is a challenge fund set up to address the needs of business enterprises operating in both the formal and informal sectors of the economy of Ghana. The fund is a demand-driven response to the need of qualified and skilled labor force with the aim of increasing productivity. With a successful decade behind the SDF, the government of Ghana has received further financial support of 40 million U.S. dollars to set up the second phase of the SDF. Speaking at the Fifth Skills Development Virtual Fair in Accra on Wednesday, the president of the Association of Ghana Industries, Seth Chumakwabwa, said the second phase of the initiative is essential to prepare the Ghanaian business community for the African continental free trade area, which is set to commence in January next year. Today, CFC African Trade Continental Free Trade Agreement is with us, the FCFTA. By January next year, it is starting. A lot of SMEs are asking, how do we participate? People are even confused as to how their involvement is going to be. All they hear of or they know of is that our markets are going to be flooded. And if I'm a small enterprise, how do I also export? And it's a challenge. But here, I think skills development can play a major role. The reason is that for the small enterprise, it will be difficult for them to travel to other African countries and go and look for markets. So the strategy should be that we have aggregators, big time buyers who are buying from the small, small enterprises, putting them together and exporting on their behalf. But that aggregation is only possible when the small enterprises are able to produce to standards and the specifications. But that requires special skills. The SGF is hosted by the Council for Technical and Vocational Education and Training and managed by a consortium of farm managers from Ghana, Denmark and Canada.